So uh, since our last discussion, um, we have found a new location for the statue. Um, we have talked with uh, Henry and some members of the public and different groups. Um, we feel that this is a great location that we have. Um, right now it's still at Liliokalani Garden area. Um, that's mainly because um, what it's gonna take to pick it up and move it. We didn't wanna have to have it stored somewhere. So uh, Henry's gonna work with our, if the resolution passes, uh, Henry is going to be working with our crew to figure out a way to pull it and put it in the in the new spot. Um, other than that, we haven't received any negative comments about the new location at all. Uh, my name's Henry Bianchini. I've um, I think you know some of the history. Uh, I uh, sailed in. I built a sailboat in California. I was developing myself as an artist at that time. And I took a side trip and I built a, a trimaran, 30-foot trimaran, sailed it in. I saw the Mauna Ulu eruption sailing in from far at sea, about 300 miles. The, the whole place lit up. Uh, it gave me a, a pretty unique uh, view of what I've been living in for the last 54 years. And I created a career. I have uh, public works in all the islands. Uh, I've worked through processes more difficult than this one. And, um, and I love Hilo. And I want to read a haiku that a patron of mine uh, wrote <clears throat> when he saw the piece. Uh, he lives in Oregon. He's a retired physicist. Uh, from Oregon State, and um, and I want to read this uh, this little haiku. It says a lot about the piece. Fishermen rose out of the depths, the depths of Hilo Bay, to honor a queen, much beloved, with a gift of his only wealth. As Paul Paul Steffes. A, a, uh, <clears throat> a very uh, established physicist that's done a lot of work for humanity, and he owns some of my work. <clears throat> I have work in Europe. I've got a public piece on uh, Reunion Island. And um, so I, I went through a process that I thought was uh, the only process I knew to uh, to establish, and uh, this controversy occurred. <clears throat> so um, that's uh, that's pretty. I've got I've got letters of by artists, established artists here, but uh, there, I think there's no need to go through all that. I think um, I've probably talked enough. <laughs> well, uh, thank you, Mr. Bianchini, for creating this wonderful piece um, that, that shares mo'olelo of an old way of life and a continuing way of life for our people here. Um, so we really appreciate that. I look forward to supporting this. Um, Director Messina, I just was wondering, I, I don't know where Isles is. Where, where is that? if I can figure out the best way to explain it. Um, to a corner person. <laughs> all right, so have you been through Liliokalani Gardens? Yes. Okay, so, so say if you start over by Hilo Hawaiian and you make your way through the gardens, right as you come out of the gardens on the right-hand side is like a, a big open field where there's a pier. Okay. That's aisles over there. Okay, so not far from where it no. currently is. Okay. All righty, thank you. That's all. I just need some point Isles, of reference. Aisles is right next door to Hilo Bay Cafe. Oh, I know where that is. Okay. <laughs> All righty. Thank you so much.